Hello everybody, welcome back to Jersh Reacts. In today's video, we're going to react to Lana Del Rey, Lust for Life. Uh, the last Lana Del Rey reaction I did released a few weeks ago, and I got some mixed reception on that one, so I just wanted to clear the air a little bit. Um, I like Lana Del Rey a lot. I think that what she does is really cool and unique to her. I like the music videos a lot, even if I don't uh, always get it. I still have fun and I'm always wildly entertained watching it. Um, it is okay to criticize and make fun of something you like. You're allowed to do that. And just because I don't slip my wrists and make the video black and white doesn't mean that I'm not enjoying myself when I watch Lana Del Rey, okay? Um, now I'm assuming because a lot of people asked me to watch Lust for Life that this is going to be a, uh, maybe a, a change from the sound that I'm used to based on the reactions that I've done. Um, it also features The Weeknd and the one time that I did a reaction for The Weeknd, he had an upbeat song, even though it turned out that song was about cocaine and not about, uh, you know, dating. Uh, if you like what you see on my channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you want to support me long term to keep the channel around for your entertainment, I have links in this video description for my Patreon and my Twitch Prime. So I've got the music video pulled up. I've got the lyrics pulled up. Um, I I cannot help but think of this old Iggy Pop song that was in the movie Train Spotting, which I absolutely love when I see this title. So I'm wondering if it's it's just uh, if it's a remake of that song or if it just happens to be called Lust for Life and it's something else. Let's find out. It's like an 80s movie logo, like uh, an old Universal Pictures opening. I see like VHS tape effects, it looks like. It's an eyeball. Hey, there's a weekend. Wow. Good shit. Um, wow. This is a good song. Um, a couple things. The music progression is like three fourths of uh, the one that got away by Katy Perry. So if you want to hear me play the majority of this song, just watch my. 15,000 subscriber medley where I play the Katy Perry song. Uh, very similar there. Um, but they don't go... I'm, you guys don't care. It's not quite the same. It's still really catchy, and it's a little bit different towards the end of the progression, and I like it a lot. It's a really good melody, really cool. Um, uh, it's really cool to hear their voices together because she has a, she has a very distinct, uh, you know, old-timey, nostalgic kind of voice, and it was a beautiful melody that she was singing on her own. And then he came in with that higher octave. And I thought that they blended really well together when they sang together. Um, this is not an Iggy Pop song. <laughs> Just so y'all know. Um, the other thing that I'll say, too, as I'm, as I'm going through reactions, if you're watching my channel, whether it's just Lana Del Rey or it's the other artists, 
just remember, you don't know what you don't know. Uh, you know, you didn't know what you know until you learned it or you were taught it. So somebody told you or you found out. And all this stuff that I'm watching blind, I find out a lot after the fact and probably will discuss further in my revisit series. Um, yeah, I like the effects too. I like that VHS effect. Let's go to the lyrics. Climb up the H of the Hollywood sign. That's what they're doing. Uh, in these stolen moments, the world is mine. There's nobody here, just us together. Keeping me hot like July forever. I like that, I like that imagery. Because uh, we're the masters of our own fate. We're the captains of our own souls. There's no way for us to come late. Because, boy, we're gold. We're gold. Uh, take off your clothes. They say only the good die young. That just ain't right because we're having too much fun. And a lust for life keeps us alive. So, yeah. That's really... Um, even though it is musically very similar to the Lana Del Rey song or uh, sound, this song, the message of you know enjoying life, and you know maybe not singing about being born to die or just you're off playing your video games when we should be together. This is like two happy two happy people together, loving that they're young, loving that they're together, and you know being lustful towards living. I love his singing voice and I love her lower octave harmonies right now. Or actually it's its own melody, I suppose. That's cool, it's like a ship. Don't slip and fall. Don't do it. Dude, I love that effect at the beginning and the end of the video. That VHS tracking, man. Yeah. Is that like a world peace symbol upside down? Musically, it was really cool. I kind of feel like, um, that's not what I said to do. Here we go. Uh, yeah, that opening is awesome. I kind of feel like um, it was a good mixture of them musically too, because even though I've only heard that one song from The Weeknd, um, 
don't even remember the name of it. I just remember the melody and the sound. Uh, it sounded like they fused the music as well as the melodies. Like, that did not... Like, most Lana Del Rey is, like, I don't know, acoustic, piano, orchestral. And this had, like, a synth and a bass. And it just seemed like they really wanted to converge their talents musically and melodically. Uh, and I thought they sounded really good together. Um, and I do... Um, love this again this this aesthetic that she uses i really like that vhs now i'm trying to figure out so she must have been like a pop star on an old television show and and then she so she like you know gets her tv spot done and then just goes on a date with her boyfriend and they hang out on the hollywood sign and that's the video you know um it was good green screen too um yeah I liked the song a lot, and I liked the video a lot. I really, uh, I got a really funny idea for like a parody video because it's fun to have fun when you like stuff. It's okay. Um, man, yeah, their voices together sounded really cool. Did they sing on any other songs together? Let me know. I uh, liked the song in the video a lot. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Comment down below. Let me know what the song means to you. And yeah, if, if they collaborated again, let me know. I definitely want to hear them again. And if you have any other requests for reactions on my channel. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.